Hello, God's children. Jesus loves you. The update on the rapture and Pope Francis I, Peter the Roman, the last pope. Jews prepare to evacuate Ukraine. Earthquake a 6.3 magnitude struck northern Thailand. With the earthquakes going on in the world and the Russia and Ukraine, the little war that's going on there, we do not know the day and the hour our Lord Jesus comes back. Only the Father knows. Redemption is nigh. Be ready. Pope Francis I, Peter the Roman, the last pope. Let me take you to Matthew chapter 16, verse 18 through 19. And I say unto thee, that thou art Peter, and upon this rock I will build my church, and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. And I will give unto thee the keys of the kingdom of heaven, and whatsoever thou shalt bind on earth shall bound in heaven. And whatsoever shall loose on earth shall be loosed in heaven. Petrus Romanius, the final pope, is here. Pope Benedict XVI resigned from office on February 28, 2013. And the last pope that resigned was about 600 years ago. That was Gregory XII. He resigned in 1415. Okay, when the pope... Benedict resigned on February 28, 2013. On that same day, a lightning bolt struck St. Peter Cathedral Dome. Let me take you to Luke chapter 10, verse 18. And he said unto them, I shall behold Satan as lightning fall from heaven. Ironically, the first pope ever to resign from office was also a Benedict. Pope Benedict the Ninth in 1045 AD resigned. In 1139 Irish Catholic Archbishop St. Malachy received a vision which revealed to him that there will be 112 more popes from this time. And the last pope Malachy said would be called the Peter the Roman which is Petrus Romanius. Malachy was right about the 111 before that one and uh, he gave descriptions about them, and they all, you know, came true. Uh, the current pope right now is Pope Francis the first, and he's number one twelve in, in Malachi's vision. Malachi stated that the last pope that he'd be known as Peter the Roman, and he will be the last pope. Malachi lists one hundred twelve pope as uh, Peter the Roman, who is going to be the pasture his sheep into many tribulations. And when these things are finished, the city of seven hills, which is Rome, will be destroyed and a dreadful judge will judge his people. The exact, the exact time the new pope was announced to the world had a shocking number. Pope, the Pope Francis I was announced 7.06 p.m. Italian time. 7.06 p.m. Also, it could be expressed as the 6 hour and 66 minute, which would be at 666. The new pope was announced at that time. Uh, Bergoglio, which is Pope Francis I, his name is Bergoglio, is a Jesuit. Also, Bergoglio means better world. Um, he's the first ever Jesuit as a pope. He's the, the, Jes he's the highest ranking official with the Jesuits and this is called the Father's General. He is known as the Black Pope. He is the first Black Pope to carry several symbolic meanings associated with evil. Nostradamus also mentioned there will be a Black Pope in the ends of times. Bergoglio's parents are Italian, making Bergoglio's bloodline Italian as Roman. The Roman Empire was the largest empire in history. Italy was the place of the originally Roman Empire. To be known as Roman is an ancient designation denoting as being from Italian. Thus the Roman Empire, not the Italian Empire. Bergoglio took himself as a name as St. Francis of Assisi. St. Francis of Assisi's middle name was Peter. St. Francis was born in Italy. Pope Bergoglio Francis I 
He is known as the Black Pope Jesuit, known as Peter the Roman, Petrus Romanianus. He was announced at 7.06 p.m., which is the 6 hour and 66 minute. I believe he will be the last pope. But his role being the end of times, we will not know. But we have to be ready. Jesus is coming back soon. Jesus loves you. God bless.